A police standoff in Bibb County ends with one man dead. Tyler Goodson, known by many for his role in the wildly popular podcast S-Town. Good evening, I'm Pam Huff. And I'm Ariel Bailey. ABC 3340's Cynthia Gould has more on how the officer involved shooting unfolded. Cynthia? Muriel Elias says shortly after midnight, Woodstock police were called to a home on Georgia Loop. Goodson barricaded himself inside and a standoff followed. Hours later, it ended with Goodson shot after he reportedly waved a gun at officers. Tyler was just a, a talented young man. For his life to end like yes, was this just a tragedy. Woodstock Mayor Jeff Dodson says he's known Goodson's family for more than 30 years. Tyler was his neighbor. Tyler's someone's son, and their father, he had five children. John didn't mention that stuff was Tyler's. You see, me and John have been planning on building something out there for a while now. The 2017 podcast S-Town set and recorded in Woodstock put the small town of 2000 on the map. The theme, a supposed murder cover-up, Tyler Goodson, a central figure. What did it mean for this town? Were people upset about it? Well, when I said this of the, of the podcast, it wasn't a documentary, but it was an incredible story, and some things were true, some things weren't. Goodson reportedly suffered from depression, and the early morning police call was a domestic situation. Depression's a a thing that we've all experienced and it's harder on some than it is others. And with Tyler being uh, uh, well known through the podcast uh, of S Town and being friends with Mac Moore, I mean, um, that could wear on him too. Uh, that The court case he had with that, I mean, he, he had a tough time. Mayor Dodson says he met with the family Monday morning. Keep our town and, and the Goodson family in your prayers. Now the mayor says this situation especially tough since so many of the officers knew Goodson, who was just 32 years old. Every attempt, he told us, was made to end this standoff with no one hurt. Pam? Cynthia Gould reporting.